I'm back in the kitchen. Don't know if you've spotted anything different. Got a nice sign. Uh, and I thought I'd do another food review because like, it's a Monday. Normally on a Monday I would go on my exercise bike and do a bit of exercise. But instead I'm eating donuts. So, um, yeah. I went to Project D Donuts, which make mega massive donuts. I don't know where they're based, but you buy them online. And they are a lot of like little pop-up shops and like Stoke-on-Trent events and things. If you're from Stoke, search for some donuts and uh, yeah, we'll go from there. Project D Christmas Special Donuts. All I need now is a knife. Um, there we are. Sorted. So we have a, what looks like, looks like a snowman. Uh, vanilla, apparently, the man said. A normal plain chocolate donut. Another vanilla one with lemon curd on. So these are the size of my face. They're not small. And then finally another chocolate one with a uh, chocolate orange. Yeah, I'm not going to eat I'm not going to eat all of it. I do like making these food review videos because it means I can eat food. And what I was going to suggest as well is we do like a little giveaway. I'm not doing a giveaway before. There's quite a few people that are on this channel now, so uh, I'll give away some donuts. Nice, but it's just a chocolate donut. There's no uh, filling in this one. And it doesn't really taste very orangey. It's just a chocolate donut. I think the, the, the slice of orange on the side just there is about all you're getting. And maybe the bit underneath was perhaps a bit orangey as well. Now, I'm not that much for lemon curd really, so... Um, Straight away, just with the icing, you can taste the lemon. This one's nicer than that one, I would say, because it's got more flavour. A bit of lemon. Because it's got the lemon icing going over the top, it gives it the flavour throughout, so you've not just got the little bit on the one side like on that one, you've got it all the way across with the uh, lemon curd in the middle for that extra bit of lemony. Now with all the donuts, they're all ring donuts, and if you've got any filling, they're normally filled in the middle, like with uh, these two just there. So they are just like a plain, normal, like vanilla donut, which is uh, probably the best kind to be honest. Don't want to get that jam rubbish. Uh, this chocolate is nice. It's different than that one. I'd probably say that that's the nicer chocolate one of the two. And just to be sure, that one's definitely nice. That one's a bit too chocolatey. Maybe the whites on the top of that one, because this one's just plain chocolate with uh, icing. And then finally, we're left with the um, the snowman. Uh, maybe orange in the middle, I don't know on that one. We'll test it out in a second. Now, going back to what I said before about uh, some donut giveaway, what I was thinking was, I'm going to order some Project D donuts and send them straight to you. Watching now, the winner. So comment the word below, mmm, donuts, like Homer Simpson, because we all love a good donut. And uh, I'll pick a random winner in the next couple of weeks. Now, yeah, we'll send you some uh, box of donuts out, but make sure you subscribe, and make sure you like the video, and then comment, mmm, donuts. Okay, so here we go. Definitely an orange flavour, but that's because I've just had, had a mouthful of the orange bit. Um, let's go for the, the bit without, just the icing. No orange flavour, just white icing on that one when you don't have the, the orangey curd bit in the middle. Mm. Nice. So the uh, the big question is, which is the best? Now, that one, the chocolate ring donut, a bit too chocolatey for me. Uh, this one, it was quite nice, had the lemon on there, not too much of the lemon curd. The chocolate orange one, Always a favourite at Christmas. Wasn't very chocolate orangey, just chocolate. But it's nicer than that one. I think that's my least favourite, to be honest. And then this one, which was a um, snowman. The winner, I would say, on this occasion, was probably going to be probably the lemon one. Because it had the extra bit of flavour on there. So, lemon one, bing, bing is the winner. Now, if you want to check out these donuts, have a look for Project D, Google them. I'll put a link below so you can have a little look on there. Or if you're in Stoke-on-Trent, just go and have a look at one of your like, local fairs or Christmas market and things. There's no doubt going to be there. And you'll just see the big pink box and then you'll go, oh, 
So you ask his video, Project D, somewhere around here, bang, and then before you know it, you're 20 quid down on two boxes of donuts. Now if you're from Stoke and you like Stoke videos, you want to see some uh, different food things, drop me a subscribe, it really does help me out, it helps the channel out, it doesn't cost you anything, but it might give me an extra little penny or two on the ad that you might have watched before you watch the video. So yeah, I do appreciate it, I'll try and keep up with a local thing that's going on, different Christmas things, fireworks, or whatever's coming next year. If something opens that's interesting for food, like deep fried Oreos, I'm going to try that sometime when I get a chance, then yeah, it's worth a subscribe. Uh, and it keeps you up to date with local Stoke on Trent stuff. Now one more time, if you want some free donuts, comment below, mmm, donuts, with the S. And uh, make sure you subscribe and like the video, and I'll, uh, I'll sort you out. And I'm going to leave it there. I'm going to say thanks to Project D for the donuts that cost me 11 quid, because they're very nice. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching, thanks for subscribing, and I'll, uh, I'll see you next time. Now just what you need after you've had donuts for a vlog is uh, Becky making a big sausage and ash brown cheese sandwich. I'm struggling a bit to be fair. Nice though.